Two of the co-founders of Facebook now reportedly throwing huge financial support behind legalizing marijuana in California. According to several reports, Dustin Moskowitz and Sean Parker, who also created the music sharing service Napster, have both donated a combined $170,000 to the state's pro-pot campaign. Apparently, that campaign had recently announced it was a bit short on cash. Proposition 19, as it's called, aims to set up a way to regulate, control, and tax cannabis. It would be the first law of its kind. Voters in California will decide whether the measure will pass on Election Day, November 2nd. And there is word that several unions in California are jumping deeper into the marijuana business. Both the Teamsters and the United Food and Commercial Workers now representing over 200 pot growers and workers in the medical marijuana industry. Claudia Cowan with the news. Claudia, why are unions shifting toward, I don't know, the world of pot? Well, Trace, because they see this as a growing, pun intended, industry here in California, and it is, with thousands of people growing and selling medical marijuana and that ballot measure coming up next month to legalize recreational pot use for adults, gaining in the polls. Organized labor groups want to expand their membership, employees want benefits and workplace protections. And Trace, they say they also welcome the legitimacy that union representation brings to an industry that isn't always seen in a favorable or legal light. Trace. Yeah, and I guess the question is, what do the critics say? Because we know there are plenty of critics in this case, Claudia. There really are, and they think that the unions in this case are very misguided and that they are doing these new members a disservice by encouraging them to do work that is considered a crime under federal law. Anti-pot advocates say rather than getting benefits, these workers ought to be sanctioned. But if voters legalize marijuana here in California next month, labor experts predict that even more unions, perhaps the United Farm Workers Union, will want to get involved, not just as negotiators for employees, but as allies for marijuana growers to help fight off the legal challenges that are certain mm. to come from the federal government. Back to you. Certain indeed. Claudia Cowan, live for us in San Francisco. Claudia, thank you. Well, you save your pennies.